Welcome back to Improvision Entertainment. My name is Huntermon, and this is going to be more of Stellaris. And uh, I have taken back a number of territories, though they, I believe, are bombarding one of my planets. They tried to pincer maneuver me. I've been having fun for the last couple minutes, and they realized I wasn't recording. Um, because, you see, the AI seems better. I don't know if it's knock it down a difficulty level for me personally yet, but they almost pincer maneuvered me. Because I was flying at their systems, taking them from one direction, and they were about to have another ship come up behind me, another cr a crew of the same power. And the two power levels were going to be too much for me, and I, I turned around, and I went back, and I dealt with them, and like, I've taken back a lot of my systems. Though they are flying in from behind and trying to take more. But right now what's going to happen is I'm going to come here. I think I can take this group now, and I'm going to try and do it. They keep running ahead of me, getting beat up by star bases. But I am now chasing them pretty fast. Oh, come on. Come on. Uh, I couldn't tell if they jumped away or if I killed them. But everybody needs healing now. Wait, hold on. That's fine. Oh wait, hold on, that's not fine. We didn't get close enough to actually claim the starbase. There we go. Go heal up. Wait, hold on. Why is that red? Actually, it's probably too far away. Hang out here for a second, guys. Reinforce. We may have lost a cruiser. We've got a science vessel who's ready to research all of the various damages that have occurred. Our cruisers are making the difference. Intellectual booty. Better thruster tech. Uh, let's grab Advanced Strike Craft. We're gonna make one hell of a battleship as soon as this war is over. Oh, I've already war exhausted them to 100%. Which means I need to stop them from bombarding my one planet. But this place is fortified with a fortress and an energy shield. And my entire army I had placed. Which is a 1.4k garrison. So as soon as these base ships are healed up, which they are now, I'm going to tell the Corvettes to follow the cruisers. Wait, hold on, not yet. Actually, they can heal up first. Okay, I think we can take them if we go together. Wait, why do you own this disabled gateway? Night Morphus with a party of six. Well, welcome Night Morphus and your party. All right, that ship is fully healed up. I would like to encourage each and every one of you to consider following my channel, but also to vote in the current poll of what games I'll be playing on stream this month. And welcome Night Morphus and everybody who's raiding. It's good to have you. Uh, party's going better than it was the other night. <laughs> Flotsam salvaged. Things are improving. Uh, let me see. I need to upgrade. Speaking of improving things. Oh, those are... Wait, what? Oh, okay. Speaking of improving... Uh, let's go with save. I hope everybody's having a good time. 
I sure am. I enjoy Stellaris. Chip is currently being built. Damn. Just select auto upgrade so I don't forget to do it. Oh, well, I mean, the problem with the auto upgrade, Nightmorphous, is that it it do, it lacks the nuance of when you don't need a new power core to power your ship, and then it just spends the alloys extra that you don't need on stuff. Very, very, very true about the um, defense platforms. The, def the def defense platforms are really terrible about sucking too much power that you don't need. Never thought about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, I have the best power core. I have the best guns. I have the best this, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, okay, if you don't want to pay attention to it. But when you are have as poor economy as I often do, um, you want that nuance. Furthermore, sometimes you just need a brand of ship that can take um, small star bases, right? So you only need, like, I don't know, like five or six... Uh, Corvettes or something of a certain power level and if you had those set to auto upgrade they would just become expensive even though you didn't need them to be more powerful for what they were doing basically okay I gotta remember to finish those upgrades in a second alright you go over there And you guys are catching up. Eight? Oh man. Cruisers are way, way improved. Where did, where did my Corvettes go? Oh, that's just the icon for set to follow. Okay, one second. Supremacy. Ship upkeep and naval capacity increase. Alright, I'm going to need you Jagoffs to stop harassing my planet. Loot from enemy Rex seized. Cool. Now we're gonna take the army off of this planet. We're gonna set them to follow the corvettes, which are following the cruisers. The cruisers are about to heal up because they have hull regeneration, which is crazy good now. Like, you can visibly see it doing. We're going to go over here, and we're going to take this starbase, and then we're going to take the next starbase, and then we're going to turn around and have starbases. So we're going to go all the way up over here. We might need to click reinforce on a couple of these dudes. Unfortunately, the Corvettes don't have hull regeneration, which I guess they should? No, because evasion makes it so that they are less likely to get hit in the first place. My naval capacity is way more than I need it to be right now. Uh, administrative complex. Uh, like I said, guys, uh, that poll that's currently running is for what games I'll be playing in the month of uh, April. You can do exclamation point uh, vote in the chat if you missed the link. And um, consider following the channel. You'll get notified when I go live. And then if you vote in the poll, you'll be able to possibly determine what games I'll be playing that you'll get notified that I went live. Jump drive hype. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I already know who my bad guy is because I selected it, like my endgame crisis. Alien megastructure built. They built a gateway. Interesting. These guys are just annoying me. Oh, wait, those guys are smaller than my cruisers. How big is this starbase? Oh, I don't, I don't need all you guys. 
Um, you can go heal. And then chase them down. Oh, hold on. Uh, but I will need the army to follow the cruiser. Hey, look, they're backing up. Healing up good? Okay. Look at you! Look at you trying to get stuff going on before your war exhaustion is totally maxed out. Man, I like this new AI. I wasn't convinced, but I am. I am convinced. We're gonna push forward into their territory. Why was the army ahead? That was weird. Okay. Your star base is now mine. Gonna wait for my cruisers to heal up. Then attack this next star base. Double check my claims. Both of those are claimed. I want to get it before their war exhaustion hits. Uh, these guys are all healed up. You retook the starbase like a bunch of dinguses. <laughs> Alrighty. That's the way it's going to be, boys. I wish I could heal. Oh, what the hell? Go away! Go an actual way! <laughs> oh no, it's... Ah, it's doing that starbase thing again. Damn it. Sometimes cruisers have a hard time hitting Starbase. I don't know why this happens, but they start, like, losing. Even though there's no reason for them to do so. Look, I got fucking cruisers jumping away and shit. Technology secured. What the hell? It's so annoying. Um... Development speed. I do... Oh, come on, no! I'm... Guys, clean it up. See how fast that goes? Man, I got beat the hell up because of that nonsense. Okay. I have not fully surveyed these systems. Um... Guys, go away. Oh, wait. I need the army to land on the... There's a planet here. There's two planets here. 300... 7... Okay, okay. Well, actually, no. I need you to heal. No, I need you to heal. Heal. Okay. We're gonna briefly split you guys into two. And we're gonna attack both planets simultaneously. And you're gonna wait in orbit. You should start healing up in a second. Research complete. More researching. Cruiser hole point. Sounds good to me. Oh boy. 
Pop abducted. Thank you. A robot pop was abducted. Wait, where did it say they went? They went to Doxy. Cool. I'll just yoink. Wait, that's not Doxy. Doxy has plenty of jobs for the moment. I'm actually losing on gases. That's moats. That's moats. Yes, damn. <laughs> Uh, wait, you're missing. How close am I to running out of exotic gases? I'm not that close. But still. Technology secured. Hey, blue lasers. You go, science ship. Like, seriously, prepare to leave. Because they're coming. They coming! You can't fly back and help me out here. That's unfortunate. Okay. What size are the... Did the f ship's emergency jump back? No, there's one. Alright, well, we'll just leave him there for the moment. Let's watch what happens. You know, a general. Army morale and army damage. Sounds good. Hey, there you go. No, no, no. Keep going. Keep going. Go, go, go. Get up. No, I don't need help. I don't need help. Go up. No, take my ship back. Bit confused friendship. Go. Damn it. doing what is this dance let's see if we can get more pops All right, well. We're almost at high war exhaustion here, so... I don't have any more armies that finished while I was away, do I? Nope. These are the only armies? So, you, you, I went to war with the army I had. At least they're both bombarding the planets at the same time. Oh, I got another one. Robot Pop. On Doxy. Um, click. Summon the fleets. War has been declared against us. Holy God. What is it with you people? Wait, what? Who are you? 
You... This war went on for so long that you started the last war again. <laughs> you assholes, go away! <laughs> for anybody who is tuned into stream, <laughs> this is the war I was doing when this started <laughs> again, but I got... I, I got it to a stalemate so that nobody got anything out of it. Then this war that you came into stream watching me play when the raid happened is going on. And now it's been, I guess, more than 10 years. And so they restarted the last war. What the fuck? Go away. I can see all your shit. Are you more powerful than me? Do I need to worry? I don't think I need to worry. God damn it. Shut up. My starbase is almost 30k. I don't think you assholes have 30k. You can just sit over there on the other side of my door banging like that one time in Seneca. Trying to get in. It's not happening. Fuck off. You have... 20k. It is versus a starbase, so there is a chance you can take them. So that sucks. But we will see what happens. Oh, we will see. I will also click upgrade on all these things. Go away! Nobody wants you. On the upside, regardless of what happens, I'm about to hit 100% war exhaustion in the second war. Before we go back to the first war part two. So this, this is ending one way or the other. Alright, while that is happening, I'm going to be paying attention to these troop movements. Oh wait, I'm Technology sorry. Secured. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yay, I have jump drive. Woo. Okay, in any event. Survey speed? You know, it'll, res it'll reset the clock if I get survey speed. Let's, let's, get, let's get other suggestions in here. That's a rare tech. Get it out of the way. I don't need survey speed at this point. Hey, look! I grabbed another pop! Is it a robot pop? No, it's a Lamont. I don't know what a Lamont is. I don't see them in my demographics. Um... More allies? Alloys, please? Oh, wait, hold on. That's... But that's more... Moats. Um... I'm kind of not great on moats at the moment. Fine, we'll do a basic job. Ah. Huh. Shut up! They wish to speak with us. Yeah, they want to speak with us because we don't have their system right now. Oh, we're at 100%. Everybody keep track. Roughly, let's say it happened in August. So, 23-31-8 is when I will be forced to accept peace. As the devastation rises, I grab more pops, and I believe also, um, yeah, dudes take more damage. Their war exhaustion should actually be like 140% or something. That, that might be an interesting mechanic if you could, like, just put in the math. What did I grab? Another robot pop. I haven't had time to fix my economy. So many pops! We're low on food. We're deadly low on food. Let's fix that. I 
I gotta have time to win both wars. Or win both planets. So when this hits, let's say 08. No, actually, maybe do it now. Now when this when this group pops. Intellectual booty. Nope, too long. Eight. Okay, let's um let's land the army here. Um. Even more energy credits will be useful. Speaking of energy credits, uh, let's buy some food just in case. Oh, looks like a lot of people have messed up with the food. Okay, landing an army. Our landing party has reached enemy shores. Take you guys and help you bombard. Our landing party has crushed the enemy. All right, heal up. Go over here. Enter orbit. They wish to speak with us. We don't want to talk to them. Decline. Let me refer you to the article uh, 1473 where it says, uh, don't start nothing, won't be nothing. All right, you attacked me. You don't get to have this planet, this system. It's mine now. This is my planet. My planet. I would like to... Okay, what are we looking at? 31 something. I'm going to land it at 30, 31.4. I can't... They're not a bunch of wounded. I may not be able to take this system, but I am going to try. Alright, we're at 4. I'm pushing it to 4.5. Alright, I don't think my army is that much stronger. But we're gonna try. We did pretty well a second ago. Our landing party has reached enemy shores. Mmm, I don't think we're gonna make it, guys. Damn. Party has failed to take their planet. Alright. Intellectual booty. Merge. Just keep taking their people then. We don't have enough time to make a new army into a hello, repeatable shield. Um Well I do want that. Unnecessary amounts of energy would be good, too. Damn. Well, we, we'll at least have a new bulwark. We're going to back away from here because it no longer matters. We can't take it. Well, you know what? Let's make sure we get 100% devastation. Let's kill everyone. Right? Let's kill everyone. We cannot fight this foe. We will accept this for now. Sued for peace. Okay, this shouldn't be our system because we didn't take the planet, but What? What? What is this? What is all of this? You were going for ideology, you jack Oh, I'm very upset with you. At least you didn't break my total economy though, but I am just Something is going to get smashed. And it's not me? Wait, hold on. We can take that multiple ways. Okay. 
excuse me, I have this other war I have to deal with. We're going to take a breather at, at the conclusion of Second War um, to check out our economy. We did get a bunch more populations for our home planet because we stole them from the other guys. And um, I've never really done that before, but it was an enjoyable experience. Let's see. How do I tell how many... Like, can I get rid of housing districts? How can I tell from the technology that it'll be okay? Five districts. Do I count the other things? Nine districts, nine districts. So nine and nine is 18. 18 times two is... Um... 18 times 2 is 36. Yeah. So, I should have enough housing for 36. So, each housing slot over here is 5. 5 times 5 is 25. 25 and 36 is 57. Wait, no. No, it's not. That's not how math works. 25 and 36 is 5. Put the 11. 61. I have 76 pop. How do, wait, how does that work? How do I have enough math? Also, I don't have a governor. When did that happen? Unity from administrators. Sure. Go with that. All right. So I don't know if I can get rid of a district, so I'm not going to bother. Um, I'm going to go and set this up so that... If we need to, because you'll need it soon. Oh, I don't have a... What's it called? A transport hub? Transit hub. Um, unemployed workers and drone pops from this system will, unless subjected to other migration controls, automatically migrate to other planets with decent habitability, free housing, and jobs in systems which have transit hubs. In systems which have transit hubs. So I gotta build a transit hub on both sides. I'll put that off. We'll see what happens. That sounds like a micromanage. Like, you have to pay attention to that later. Alright, alright. So anyway. What war am I having right now? Who's in it? Wait, these guys again? Wait, these guys? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can take these guys. Last I checked, anyway. New, no, they've got buffed. Oh god damn it. They can take that star base because I wasn't I wasn't I wasn't accounting for them. Crap. Well, here we go. First war part 2. It's like first blood part 2. Intellectual booty. Oh man, they took that so fast. I was expecting to be at war for all time. Alright, uh, real talk though. Um, we just ended a war, and we're getting into a new war. So for everybody who's watching later on YouTube, I would like to thank you for watching. This has been Stellaris, presented by Improvision Entertainment. I have been Huntermon, and I will see you in the future.